Want to see more cool videos on our channel? We do, so press this bell and enable to send notifications. Have you ever seen those cool forging machine videos on YouTube or Instagram that absolutely took your breath away? Aren't those videos completely satisfying and awesome? Do you think you can ever get enough of watching them? Then worry not, because Mindboggler is here to satisfy your eyes more and more. So, here are 12 extreme forging machines you definitely have to see to actually believe. Number 12. Heavy Duty Hammer The heavy duty hammer is considered to be the most important process of forging, because it delivers robustly powerful blows. There are large pieces of metal and construction blocks that have to be properly fit, where the only way to reduce them is with the help of powerful blows. The world's heaviest counterblow hammer was crafted by none other than the Schuler Group. It has the maximum energy of 14,000 kilojoules or 54,000 tons of forging press. This hammer can forge any metal that's under 6,000 pounds, which is around 2,700 kilograms. Number 11. German Forging Machines The German labor is known all around the world, so when it comes to forging machines, they're nevertheless. They have the best forging machines and engineering services, there's been one company in Germany that's mastered the technique of forging. It's the BGH Edelstahl. They use the open die techniques with their hard-hitting heavy-duty hammers that can produce bars and metal which weighs up to 30 tons. The modern machines are known to use the hydraulic forging press that produces impeccable mint-condition metal parts and pieces. Now that's something cool, isn't it? Number 10. Sorrel Forge when it comes to laying its impact on the Canadian forging industry, it's none other than the Sorrel Forge Manufacturing Company. The company is hailed for its open-die steel forging techniques. They specialize in the crafting of impeccable forged bars. Because of their in-house melting machinery, Sorrel Forge can melt anything that says metal up to 59,000 pounds, 27,000 kilograms. Be it massive round bars or elongated ones, they're pushed down with a heavy-duty hammer and made into beautiful industrial equipment. Wow, these guys can melt anything under a bright sunny day. This industrial vibe weirdly reminds me of Jack and Rose running down the boiler room. Anyone else feel the same? Number 9. Long Steel Bars Did you ever wonder how those long and lengthy steel bars are made? Not many of you know that in order to create those pristine round diameters on the steel, it requires major hard work. It's made with a robust forging hammer where the sides of the metal is flattened, and then it's cut into smaller parts so that the elongation process can begin. It's important that every part of the forging be executed perfectly. If there's any minute mistake or any careless overlooking, it can result in major disaster. Number 8. Check Precision Forges when you think about precision and forges, you should leave it to no one but Czech. The Czech Precision Forge is a major company that lays its hand into specialization of not only closed die, but also open die forging of beautiful metal alloys. They have in-house production of heat treatments and forging tools, which means they have total control of what goes on. Any tool or steel can be made up to 8,000 pounds or 4,000 kilograms. Number 7. Rectangular Bars What's the opposite of round metal pipes? You guessed it, it's the rectangular bars. Since the forged bars are stronger and harder and very durable, it's obvious that most of the manufacturing companies opt to do the metal processing through forging. Extreme pressure is applied to heated metals, which further forms the steel into a right and perfect shape. These metals cannot abstain from strong force where they tend to align the grain. This means that the metals receive a pristine internal structure and better construction. If you want to know how perfectly the square and rectangular bars are made, it should be considered as to how long these bars can be and how much their net weight is. Different metals have their own set of capabilities and limits when their length and size is considered. If the material is of alloy steel and carbon steel, it can be as long as 220 inches or 5.5 meters, where it weighs a major 60,000 pounds or 27,000 kilograms. But when it comes to super alloy and stainless steel, it can be up to 60 inches or 1.5 meters and can weigh only 15,000 pounds or 6,800 kilograms. These square and rectangular blocks are long flat forged metal, which is precisely laser cut since they're heated up to 1,500 degrees Fahrenheit or 800 degrees Celsius. Rectangular bars are used in various construction sites and for various purposes, hence it's always in high demand. Number 6. Gear Forging 
There are many types and sizes of gears crafted every day, where these gears go through immense casting, forging, extrusion of specific detailed curves and round shapes, and it's achieved with diligent work. Before the casting process begins, the first and major step is to spike up the heat of the metal, which will gradually take its beautiful form. This commencing process is known as blanking. The blank gear is then headed towards the actual production, where wide and long cylinders are pushed down by robust hammers in order to achieve the expected length and width. The next step in the process is that a small round hammer is driven up in the new small deer, which will create the iconic hollow inside the metal. The next step after this is nothing but the good old polishing and shaping. These wide-ender diameter gears require extension by metal, which further pull apart the hot steel in order to gradually form the thin-width equipment. With regards to casting, these hot metal gears are kept under hammers, which have minute details on it. The gear is then pushed down on the steel until the expected form and shape is made. When it comes to shapes, the forging machines are pro at it, because any type of gear shape can be produced. The utilization of these newly made gears can extend from small pocket watches to big automobiles that require heavy gears. Phew! A heck of a process gears have to go through, don't you think? Or were you bored by the process? Let us know in the comments below. Number 5. Francini Acciao Pipes this is one major company that's made a complete name for itself as the global forging processor. From power generation equipment and tools to the major mechanical industry equipment, there's no single metal which this company cannot forge. They are that extensive. When it comes to rotor shafts, generator motor and steel pipes, they can be made to have different shapes and functions. Large pipes are some of the hardest equipment which they get to manufacture and produce. The crafting process of it is not easy since it requires for hemmant attention to detail and lots and lots of determination. With regards to long and extended pipes, there are major materials used like nickel alloys and stainless steels. These pieces of steel are first kept in the upper and lower dies and then the heat and pressure mold is applied so that the metal can form into its desired shape. Then the forging hammer is used with incredible force where the heated metal is pushed down in order to give it its exterior, which is smooth and round. After the epic cylindrical shape is made, the next step is to add intricate details and casting the overall ends of the pipe. Forging pipes have their own advantages because the metal is forged using the heavy-duty hammers, where it eventually creates a flawless alignment, and the end result is nothing but robust product which is used in major industries. Forging is the most economical and cost-effective way to produce an equipment that's seamless and is highly durable. Number 4. Steel Balls did you ever see perfectly forged round steel balls? Then you definitely must be curious as to who would make them and what the process is. The Shandong Irater Company is one such that has 40 years of experience in forging. This company is the leading forging enterprise of China and expands over 120 countries. If you think that any business needs clear and robust steel balls, then this company is the one they should opt for. They create impeccable quality products with utmost precision. But how are they made, you must be wondering. The company has four hot-rolled steel ball production lines on the go that work strenuously to create perfect round products. The long raw materials are heated and then the rod is cut down into little pieces and rounded until the edges of the balls have to be uniform, not only in shape but also in hardness. The Shandong Irater has an impeccable state-of-the-art reheating system where the newly heated up round balls are rolled out from the heated shafts where further down hardening and heat treatment takes down repeatedly. Because of this, its reshaping and rehardening, the company produces the ultimate and unique steel balls that are robust and high quality. Number 3. Notching A lot of tools and metal equipment require detailed designs and outward structure so they can be accommodated in the overall function. Unlike forging, which is done by only machines and hammers, notching requires extra help from humans. Lead pipes are one such that include notches and help in parallel attachments. Although the smaller size tools can be matched and further edited with the help of abrasive notches which can do the job, the other massive hot metals require a lot of attention. Number 2. Sumitomo Heavy Industries The Japanese are known for their impeccable work ethic that can literally move mountains. Sumitomo Heavy Industries is one such that's majorly known for its precise work ethic. They began their operations in 1960, and since then the company works through large-scale tools and heavy equipment that produce the best results all the time. They have three different forging presses where many casts and products are made on a daily basis. They also have smaller size machines with less than 2,500 tons of press force, which can craft products like small diameter gears, 
connecting rods, and other tools. Their press is famously known for its major accuracy and high productivity. The company can also coin and twist the newly formed hot metal through the modern hydraulic presses, which is specially made for twisting. Number 1. Spiral Bending in this video, we've seen spiral pipes, rectangular bars, and flat gears that are all made by forging machines, but let's dive in deep towards a more unique shape. Spiral bending is done with the help of metal heating and forging, where this technique is flawless and all striking twisted metal rods are produced. The overall work might appear easy and simplistic, but always remember that the forging process is such that it requires extensive attention to the precise details. The twisted spirals are made with the help of rolling hammers, the first step in the production is the heating up of the metal, where long and thin metal rods are placed in the heating compartments, which will heat up the steel to a major temperature. Next, as soon as the desired temperature is achieved, the rods are wheeled out and placed under the metal cast. Since the rods are newly heated up, it'll wrap around the metal and with the help of a set diameter, the tool is produced. Since the hot rods encompass the casting, a powerful rolling hammer is pushed down against the material. Because of the steady rolling movements, the hot rod is uniformly wrapped and as soon as the desired shape is achieved, it's cooled down and readied for shipment. So now you know as to how these metal spirals are produced. Thank you so much for watching and if you enjoyed the video, please let me know by clicking the like button. Do share, write a comment and don't forget to subscribe so that you can catch up my next video.